What is up, ladies and gentlemen? My name is Creepers, and I'm here back with another video. Now, ladies and gentlemen, you probably have read this, the title by now, and yes, the cars inbound are going to to go away. It's going to go away. This system is now officially uh, the the Harris team has officially said it's over. It's over because they 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 said it themselves on a Reddit post. Uh, we are not blind. We know that people don't like it, so we're gonna terminate it, and we're gonna start a new system that people will enjoy. Uh, by way, by saying that they will enjoy us, we will enjoy. They mean also that things will be free. We will go back into the point system, and now we have a 15 point limit. If you guys remember, for those who have been in my channel for as long as I've said this, I did said that the best way to actually remain with this. I didn't say about the free cards, but legendaries should not have levels and we should be able to put up to 15 points in the deck. That's exactly what they're doing, so <laughs> I don't know, but I'm pretty lucky because this is what I wanted and I believe that a lot of people wanted this as well. I believe a lot of people are going to be happy. Um, in other news, uh, this will not be the only thing. Uh, legendaries will now be called talents. And the, the talents will be unlocked through level. So you guys are probably like, Oh shit, but now I don't have all the legendaries! Yeah, it's called talents now, and no, you don't. You, you have to unlock them at level 1, 5, 10, and 15. And they already said that they're going to be adding new talents. Legendaries, I'm just trying to get used to the name, guys. Um, but they're going to be adding new talents to the game. Um, and also, they also said that they're going to remove the limit level for all of the champions that it's level 25. So people who are level 25, I know a lot of people who are level 25 at certain champions, and they're probably like, oh, pfft, what do I do after level 25? It doesn't really matter to me to play with that champion anymore. Well, now you can still play with it, and maybe we'll get rewards with time. That If you get to level 30, or maybe they will even make it easier uh, to get to level 20 at least, so we can get to titles a lot faster. Um, as I said before, the cards now will be free. Unfortunately, the talents will be through level, which I, th I still think a lot of people don't want. Um, but even worse than all of whatever you're thinking that it's bad right now, is Battlegrounds will be removed. Unfortunately, they said that they have to make some major changes, and so they will be removing the, the alpha version of uh, the Battlegrounds, and they said that even this week that it's uh, the the um, they're going to be putting it on PDS with the new major changes. I got to tell you guys, I've been you know I've been seeing the battlegrounds since the beginning, and I've seen so many changes that I can't even recognize the mode that I initially saw. Now the 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 base structure is still there, eight champions, two of each rank, two two of each class, um, and it's a hundred players. One or four will survive, the fog comes, and etc. Now, this uh, basic uh, structure is there, but they've changed so much when it comes to items, legendaries, talents, whatever you want to call them. Before, it were, they were just items, like body, head, uh, and boots, or core, whatever it was. And now, it completely changed. We have now the items from the store that we buy in the normal game. Uh, we also have legendaries. It's completely insane, and they already said they're going to be changing a lot more than just this. They're going to be changing a lot of things. Um, you know, I, I'm actually happy with this. I would rather wait one more month and have a battlegrounds that it's 100% perfect, than actually just wait. Uh, not wait, just get the mode, and you know, just have to go through all of the changes and not even be able to get used to the game because they're changing it completely. Might as well just wait, guys. I know a lot of people wanted to play it. I'm on the console like a lot of people, so we would have to wait even more. But still, guys, it's better wait and have a better mode than actually just, you know, just want the mode, and then when you notice, it's pretty damn shit. Um, maybe I shouldn't, I shouldn't have said the, the damn shit. So sorry. <laughs> um... Uh, they also said they're going to be trying to, some of the goals they are having for 2018 
is they're going to be listening to our concerns and being as transparent as possible in addressing these concerns. This is what the, it's on the Reddit post. I probably have to, to put the link on this video. I think I did a video about OB66 and I didn't put the link there, but as soon as I can, I will be putting it there. Um, they will also be releasing high quality updates. Uh, you know, for, because of the, the quality and etc. I think they still need to fix something up because uh, some people I know that played on the PC now because of the new change of the 64 bit. Um, some of them can't even start the game. It's like it's completely bugged. It's really hard to actually even try to play there. Uh, so let's see if they can actually change it a little bit. Um, and also, they also said they were going to buy, uh, try to listen as po you know as uh, equally as possible to both PC and console players. This is actually pretty good, because we have problems on the console that has n have never been uh, targeted by the team, which I don't say they're not trying their best, but at the same time, it's kind of hard being a console player and knowing that the PC players have a little more advantage than us, because they do not just get the patch earlier, but they also get a lot more listening about the bugs and etc. And that's bad. But you know they're gonna try to fix it, and that's actually um, that's actually pretty good. They're also saying that they're gonna be improving the art quality of our game of Paladins. I think that they, they're talking about like the the images, screenshots, even the quality of the two characters itself. You know they're gonna be changing as much as they can. Um, they're also saying focus, focus, focus on the core game experience and the core community for the competitive hero shooter gamers we lo all love. They're basically saying, you know, the, the, this is more about um, both Paladins and Smite. They're trying to say that they're going to be focusing the maximum possible. And this is basically it a little, a little for now. I don't want to make this video like too long. Um, they also said that they're going to be tuning in tomorrow, so probably it's about today or even tomorrow, I'm not entirely sure when it is, uh, at 1 p.m. I think this is in uh, Pacific time. I'm not entirely sure, guys. You should definitely check it out. They're going to be doing the dev inside. You should uh, wait and wa watch it. Maybe there's going to be new information there, which I haven't. Uh, released on this video and yeah guys if you have enjoyed this information that I just gave to you like a lot of people probably still don't know about this if you did enjoy this please leave a like and comment down below saying if you're a new or not uh, if there's anything I did miss I think I didn't but even if I did I appreciate if you guys can actually call me out uh, also for people who aren't freaking frequent on the channel or didn't even know me before my name is Creepers I'm a youtuber of games but right now I'm focusing a lot more on Paladins than anything else especially because I'm a console player um, and in the near future if I can get a computer I'll start start to do more videos on PDS and etc but never leaving the console uh, also I will be doing God of War release stream uh, soon enough as soon as it comes out so if you guys don't want to miss that make sure to subscribe you don't miss any of my future videos I do Fortnite uh, Paladins, God of War, Assassin's Creed, Call of Duty, and so on. So if you don't want to miss any of that and you aren't subscribed yet, please subscribe. It helps a lot. Just having a subscription, even if you're not about to watch my videos, uh, I wouldn't usually say this, but it's still pretty good. I would appreciate if you guys could help me out. You guys are amazing for all the support and feedback you have been giving me. I hope you guys enjoy the rest of your day just like I will. And, uh, you know, my name is Creepers, and I'll see you guys on my next video.